Explorer Project. It's the intersection in the middle of the road where Arts and myself meet. It's a place that I can just explore with total freedom and I don't have to do it entirely on my own. See, they used to think or believe that inspiration was this kind of entity or spirit that used to visit you or used to live somewhere or just be with you at times, you know. And by having that mindset, I think that inspiration has its own persona, meaning that somehow I can share that responsibility, you know, and just be more free in order to explore and to create all my work. I think the why it's really an ongoing answer at the moment the Explorer project was created, it was out of a really deep need to reconnect myself with art, to be as authentic and real as I am on my everyday business. Even though I don't want to just stick with one type of camera or format, I decided to work mostly with film. I believe that digital systems, they do have a lot of great benefits, especially for nowadays, but the thing is that we end up just taking a thousand photos and then just choosing the best ones, working on those ones, etc, etc and a beautiful quality that film has it's that it makes you be more intentional with your work it makes you actually to step back a little bit to breathe before taking the photo maybe to reflect on the exposure you're about to do and I think that's such a beautiful thing about working with film I think that to produce a body of work that is actually intentional and that the viewer will understand the message without the need of reading a full caption or, or a description and to produce all that in a really short period of time it is possible but you actually need a well-trained eye and I think a lot of practice, years of practice and a lot of self-reflection to be able to produce something meaningful in a short period of time. Kubrick once said, I think aesthetically recording spontaneous action rather than carefully posing pictures is the most valid and expressive use of photography. I share that statement but in order for that person to actually capture that moment he or she needs to have that eye so well trained that in the moment that situation arrives they will know exactly what to do so the instruments for me a camera or whatever is the instrument you are using to create your art to express yourself or whatever it really becomes a secondary decision. For this project, I'm really looking forward to breathe again, to actually step back and reflect on the ideas, to work together with inspiration, to give the time that each idea or project needs to grow, not rushing anything. And I'm going to be quite unapologetic with this whole thing because it's not about me, it's just about how art interacts with me or how art uses me to create something.
For that matter, I really don't have any big goals set for this project. I just want to see where it takes me. And there's also this notion or this idea that sometimes how I perceive or I see things are quite different than most of the people does. And I believe that by making this a public project, I will expose that thought. And I'm really looking forward to see how the people will interact with the project, if they will feel identified somehow, or it will be 